Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying a Cold Stone Creamery cake. This is an ice cream cake. It's called Cake Batter Confetti. This was $26.99. That's a small. Yeah, it's a, yes. So like these are our dessert plates. This is a regular size dessert plate. That's how big it is. Like I could take that cake off right now and put it on uh, the dessert plate. That's, that's the size of it. So you're supposed to get eight servings in here. So, but you only get six candy bars. Yeah, I would 100% slice that in six pieces. So, just based on their decoration. Right, <laughs> because somebody is not going to get, uh, that's a Kit Kat. So, uh, somebody is not going to get a Kit Kat. Although, it does not say Kit Kat. No, um, it's not candy bars. But somebody's not going to get one. So, these ice cream cakes, the directions are to let them lay out for 15 minutes. And so, we have let it lay out for 15 minutes. Oh, it looks like a red velvet or something, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. But it has uh, lots of sprinkles in there. So, let's see. I'm just going to... There we go. We'll see what this looks like from the side. Yeah, looks nice. So, the calories on this, it says um, eight. there's supposed to be eight servings. One slice, 141 grams, is 420 calories. We weighed my slice before the video, and this slice is 115 grams. It's actually less calories. So it's less calories than 420, yeah. but it's still probably, I don't know, probably around 3-something, 380. Probably three, closer to the, yeah, right yeah, 4 or something. Yeah, it's probably <laughs> closer, yeah, 380, 400, something like that. Um, so this is called... Cake batter confetti, and it is red velvet cake. Mm -hmm. See, I picked up, I was gonna get a different cake to review for you all, and I picked up the wrong cake. This is not the cake I wanted at all, but <laughs> it is what it is. Um, it is layers of moist red velvet cake and cake batter ice cream with rainbow sprinkles wrapped in fluffy white frosting. White now, frosting, uh, whipped cream. Yeah, back when we reviewed the Barbie cake from Cold Stone Creamery, that white fluffy frosting is literally like cool whip. It is cool whip, yeah. 100%. It's just a whipped cream. It's not frosting. So they're lying when they say frosting. Mm -hmm. That is not a frosting. The ice cream's good, and the cake is actually mm -hmm. decent. Um, the ice cream though is just really just a vanilla ice, uh, ice cream to me. You know what though, I really do like the amount of sprinkles. They put a ton of mm -hmm. rainbow sprinkles in there. And I really do like the texture. Yeah, I actually like it with the cake and all. This one has a... I think this one has more flavor than the Barbie one did. Mm-hmm. Because the Barbie one really, I mean, we, we ate it, but it's, it's supposed to be cotton candy. It's like, it didn't really taste like anything. No. This one, this is a, you know, and, and I'm just eating like the ice cream. Let me try the cake. Um, I really do like that ice cream. Like I could eat a whole cup of just that ice mm -hmm. cream. Because I'm telling you, the sprinkles add so much texture to it that it makes you want to eat more too. I even like the cake. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The cake is actually really good. It does have that red velvet chocolate kind of flavor. <laughs> Just the sprinkles <laughs> with whipped cream. Yeah. Yeah, uh, because that's all it is. Whipped cream with sprinkles. Like that. Even the little candy bar is not bad. I had a bite of just uh, just the candy bar. Um, it does remind you of a Twix, but it's a little harder. It could be because it's frozen, but. Mm, 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 mm. I like that. I love that. So this one, while the Barbie cake is one we were like, eh, I don't know if I'd get that one or not. This one's actually good. It's way too expensive for the size of it, though. Because mm -hmm. you can go buy, you can go to Walmart or Kroger, a bakery, and get a sheet cake for 30 bucks. You know, that, that feeds a lot more people than this will. Probably less than $30. Yeah. Apparently, they must make, and maybe you have to request them, they must one. make large ones because yeah. it says a large round feeds 14. We did not see, it, at least it wasn't noticeable. Mm -hmm. 
So. I mean, they did have another size of the freezer, side of the freezer. Right, maybe. and I'm wondering, they had them from top to bottom. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if maybe the smaller ones weren't at the top, which, which is where we were looking. You know, you look at, you know, at eye level. Maybe the ones at the bottom were bigger be, and we just didn't so even know. on the other side or who knows. Um, I really do I mean, like we this. wouldn't have wanted a big one anyway for us to try. Right. That. We would, would have just wanted a small one. I would just want you to know, this was twenty six ninety nine. I would think a, a big one would be uh, at least thirty six ninety nine. I would think you would add at least $10 more, but maybe not. Um, I like this so much more than the Barbie. This mm -hmm. has so much more flavor. It's very good. The, the thing with the Barbie was the ice cream was cotton candy. Mm -hmm. And when you had the ice cream in the cup, you really tasted that, that strong cotton candy flavor. Once they added it with the yellow cake, it diminished the flavor so much. Mm -hmm. And this, because it's red velvet, really just it kind of just goes together with the rainbow the, yeah, it's just the, really sweet vanilla right? uh -huh, yeah with those sprinkles and so it, as much as i love the look of the barbie one because it's so pretty and pink this one would be the one that i yeah, would, I like that this I would much more. And, and the cake and everything is really good and it's not dense or hard i also think the cake is a little thinner in this one and you get more ice cream to cake ratio you do get a, a very thick uh sections two big thick sections of the ice cream mm -hmm. uh, so that might be true yeah. uh, just although like, the barbie one had some pretty good size mm -hmm. piece of ice cream too yeah. so but yeah i think this one's better yeah this is the one this is the one this like i said this is not the one i intended to review but i'm glad we did because yeah, now we know this is a really good cake uh, so you'll have to let us know, have you tried any cakes from Cold Stone? And if you did, which ones did you have? Because they had, they had one that um, Kevin and I thought looked really good. It was a strawberry, and it looked like it had a, a thick layer of like a strawberry gel, which we love, the goo in the middle. And then they had one that was like a really, really dark chocolate, um, like I want to call it midnight or something, but I don't yeah, know what they call like, it. Something like that. And then they had the one that I wanted to buy that I thought I was buying was the cookie dough. And it actually has like cookie dough, like a layer of cookie dough in there. That's the one I thought I was buying. But they have a lot to choose from. So you'll have to let us know if, you, if you've had uh, the ice cream cake. And somebody uh, commented, I think she was from the UK. Um, she commented on the Barbie video and she said, we don't have ice cream cakes here. She said, that's hmm. not something, she said, that's not something that's done at all. And she said, where do you get those? And do people make those at home? So my response to her was, you, you, ha you get them at either an ice cream place like this. Like, so Cold Stone, Graders sells cakes, Dairy Queen I don't sells know if they cakes. have a lot of ice cream specific stores you just go out and buy ice cream maybe they do but I, oh in the uk yeah i don't remember seeing any they might i just don't remember any i know well, they had candy shops, she was specifically talking about cakes yeah ice cream cakes so but but as far that's as that's what i mean though if they don't have ice cream shops though, i don't know if they would ever have one that had have ice cream, ice cream cake. cake yeah i have never personally and kevin can answer for him I have never personally known anyone to make an ice cream cake at home. No, you could though. If you got could a, you? Yeah, if you got a mold, think about it, if you get a cake pan, mm -hmm. something that you can like pull, maybe put a parchment paper or something like that in it and press ice cream down in the bottom of it mm -hmm. and then put it in the freezer and let it get really hard and then bake your cakes and cut them really thin and sack them. You could do it. I mean, it would be a pain. I've never known do anybody to do it. I don't it. either. But you I'm, haven't either. No, but I'm just saying you could do it. I mean, mm -hmm. it's it's not like it's magic or anything. <laughs> Put it this way. I wouldn't want to do it. It'd be a it pain. would be a lot of trouble. Yeah. It would be a lot of trouble because some people would say, oh, you should do a video. I'm not interested. <laughs> yeah. I, like I said, it's possible you could do it, but you just have to buy a lot of ice cream to shove in the little pans and freeze them and get them really good and solid and pull them out. And that's why they can charge so them. much. It's because they know you're not going to want to do this at home. It's a, that's it, exactly it, right. it's a pain. It's going to be time consuming. You're not going to want to do it at home. Kind of like fried ice cream. You could do it at home, but... but it was I'd awfully rather, good, though. I'd rather buy it at the store. It was awfully good <laughs> that you made it at <laughs> home. I'd rather buy it at a restaurant every once in a while mm -hmm. than make it at home. But 
you can let us know that too. Have you ever made your own ice cream cake? Because it does seem like it would be a pain. Mm -hmm. uh, I would just as soon spend the money and let them take care of it for me. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have pictures for you at the end, and I'll also have pictures of the nutritional information and ingredients and all that. And thanks for watching.